in the year 2042, Tiny Orbit developed miniature robots to be sold on the market as children's toys. They became an overnight success, selling in unprecedented numbers. However, they were soon taken off store shelves, with parents complaining that they were too dangerous. It wasn't until the invention of a new kind of futuristic fortified cardboard that these tiny machines were able to gain a new lease on life. Within the safety of a battle box's four walls, mechanical warriors are now pitted against one another. Tough and small, these robots are known as LBX. Artemis. This place is massive! Well, it is the World Championships after all. And you know what that means. This is where you can find all the top LBX players on the planet! This is awesome! I can't wait to see who we face! Nice! You better believe we're ready for anything. Hey, look! It's Justin! Huh? Justin Kite. He's gonna be our toughest opponent. <sighs> Man, that dude is so full of himself. Yeah. But I still want to battle against him. I swear, I'm gonna take him out! Slow down. It's great that you're fired up, but we still need to win our first match. Let's take it one fight at a time. Of course, you think I don't know that? There's no bigger stage for an LBX player. Artemis, we're all fighting for one reason, to be the best in the world. But still, there's more to this. It's not just about winning a championship. Yeah, who'd have known we'd get caught up in this mess? I still can't believe everything that's happened. The fate of the entire world rests on our shoulders. And it all began on that fateful day. The day I first met that small machine. Unfortunate. So that case, it must hold what I think it does. Yes. If its contents ever go public, things won't look good. Mobilize all operatives and get it back at all costs, sir. There's, there's no turning back now. I'll deliver this, no matter what. I promise. Professor? Uh, uh, all right, guy! 
guys ready to battle?
Dad, what's that? This is an LBX miniature robot. An LBX robot? Yep. He is one brave little fighter. He can fight opponents much bigger than he is. Really? Sweet! Hey, Dad, can I have the robot? I'm really sorry, little man. I wish I could give it to you, but I can't. It's a prototype. A prototype? Yeah. It means that it's not quite finished yet. But Van, by the time you're old enough, I promise this will be ready for you to use. Just you wait, son. Okay. After that night, Dad immersed himself into developing the LBX. He worked on it non-stop. And then, there was the accident. Yesterday evening, flight PA-0227 mysteriously disappeared off of radar. The flight was a special charter carrying scientists and engineers bound for A country. They were going to the Neo Technology Summit and represented some of the nation's greatest minds. <gasps> John. However, based on the plane's location when it went missing, authorities fear the worst. And that's why Mom hates those little robots so much. Because if it wasn't for LBX, Dad would still be with us. But Mom, I wish you could understand. When I play with an LBX, I feel a connection to Dad. After all, he's the one who invented them. Even if nobody else believes it. Found her yet? We currently have operatives scouring the city. We should find her soon. Make sure we recover that item, no matter what. I was sent to give you this van. Huh? This case holds the key to saving the world. What do you mean? Found her yet? She ain't over here. <gasps> Van, there's no time. <sighs> Inside this case lies something that can bring hope or despair for all humanity. No matter what, it can't be allowed to fall into the wrong hands. This is your responsibility. Don't give it away to anyone. But why me? I wish I had the time to explain. Just remember, this is something you were supposed to have. Are you sure? Did you hear something? <laughs> Sorry! Had a big lunch. You need to get out of here quickly. <laughs> Wait! I still have so many questions!
Hey, Alma here. What? I see. Call me back if there's any new intel. Looks like it's in there. LBX. I wonder if this thing works. Going in. Roger. Man, who's controlling these things? There's no choice. If they want to fight, they got one.
Thank <laughs> you.